So, what better way to give you more information about hospital life than to give you a tour of the OR complex itself? So, um, bawal yata tong gagawin ko. Hindi ko lang sure. Still, I wanna show you what's inside the OR complex and where we do our surgeries. So, let's have a quick tour. Thank you. <laughs> and this is the recovery room. Hi. <laughs> So this is the inside, the ba ang liwanag, and the sterile room where all the ah where all the instruments are kept. Kanina there was an operation here na CS, pero at the same time while it was vacant. This was my spot while I was attempting to study. See, that's my notebook, my coffee. Nagaran naman ako, pero ang naisipan ko lang magvideo ngayon. Na selfie ka nga para mapagalitan ka. Oh, yan yeah, talaga. Hi. Hey. Hey, green pa yan. Sa yung green. Ano na ka pero? Mas maganda ka. Wow. Oh, yeah. And this is the nurse's station. By the way, if you're wondering right now, there are no ongoing cases. So all the nurses are not here. There are no patients here either. So I'm free to video. Quiet now. There's this misconception that inside the operating room it's always dark and like rushed and like super tense, but it's not. When we're in here, we can be super chill, we can even have music on, and we get to chat a little while doing our work with our hands. And it's all good and it's super fun. It's a different kind of relaxed and calm environment. I wish I could show you. Although sometimes, of course, if there are emergencies, there's really that moment, na scalpel, suction. But most of the time, it's not. Oh. Hi, Doc. What's the case today? Uh, this is the case of Papillary Thailand Carcinoma. Uh, previously, I was operated on it. But near total thyroidectomy. So, I'm going to complete it. Yes. Our ENT resident. Oh. <laughs> Thank you, Doc. And a while ago, actually, I was here in this spot attempting to intubate the patient because I was given the opportunity to do so by the consultant. He was trying to teach me and the other clerks and interns. However, the patient was a difficult case of intubation though talaga, so I wasn't able to do it. The last time I tried to intubate, it was in the emergency room in an actual patient, so it was kind of difficult. But that was actually successful. But still, it was a learning experience for me. Yay! I hope you like it. It's just a simple tour and I don't want to go into detail. So if you want to see more, come on, join us in the world of medicine. You get the scrub in, you get the help in the ORs and you're gonna love it. Bye!